Pleasure to introduce Mr. Sandeep Rana, Director at Sital Academy. He is an HBSC and MP consultant with over three decades of industry and corporate training experience. As a leader and coach, he has trained and upskilled thousands of students and professionals in HVAC and engineering subject. He has executed HVAC projects involving heat load uh, calculation, equipment installation, and the application of Six Sigma methodologies to improve productivity. Today, Mr. Rane will briefly overview us about energy saving in HVAC, HVAC design and operation. Please join me in welcoming Mr. Rane. Now, see, today I am going to discuss about the designing aspect. Now, I think earlier also we have discussed about the designing and we all know about what is about designing. This is a common uh, subject that we all uh, talk about, you know, the COP of the chiller, kilowatt per turn, and the COP should be uh, something like four, between 4 to 5.8 or the kilowatt per turn should be 0 0.61 to 0 0.87. Now, these are the aspects that which all, everybody knows and by designing a system, we all take into consideration all these things. Utilization of centrifugal fans, uh, utilization of EC fans instead of uh, place of centrifugal fans, as our earlier panelists has discussed earlier. Now, right now, everybody is going for EC panels, EC fans. So you, you do get power saving when you, you know, when you have got VFDs uh, uh, with chillers. Even in the cooling tower fan, we have got a VFD. It gets a lot of uh, power saving in that way. But my main objective today was to discuss was to the operation part of you. If you go to any organization where you have got an old AHU, where you have got the belt system, the pulley system AHU has been installed, you will be surprised to see that the, there's no proper maintenance been taking place. At places I have seen, there are three belts. And out of the three belts, only one belt is installed. The other two belts have broken long back. And nobody has bothered to take care of it. Or the pulleys are not working properly. The bearings are not uh, greased properly. And at places, even the AHU rooms are converted into store rooms. Which is a very bad uh, thing. You know, somebody putting his uh, tools and tackles and somebody is using it as a ch change room. AHU rooms are, uh, doors are kept wide open. The three-way walls are not getting operated properly. And then you have the bypass wall open kiya hai, and then it's a mentality. Na, are chalta hai na, temperature to maintain over hai na. And if you go and talk to them about the energy saving, etc., etc., then they say, yaar, baad mein sochte, yaar, abhi, rent the bed, chal hai. Matlab, everything is okay, chalo, fine. So this mentality has to be changed. The energy saving concept has to go to each and everybody, right from the top management to the lower operator level as, as well. Ki, boss, this is what you have to do. This is the need of the hour. Just by, uh, you know, I have seen people installing, even especially in hospitality industries, people using Daikin in those VRV systems so that they get power saving. And the indoors are fitted right above the door. The guest room is there, just above the guest room door, the indoor is installed. And the guest, the room the door is kept open and the indoor is running. So do you think you are going to get power saving just because you have installed a Daikin VRV? No, because your doors are open. You go and tell the guest, Ki, gentlemen, please keep the door closed. He won't keep the door closed. Oh, they may... I have paid for the air conditioning. I paid for the AC room. So whether my door is closed or whether my door is open, doesn't make any much of a difference. So I've been working in Lonawala also, in the hospital industries and hospital in steel industry also. Steel industry, we are... so nobody's bothered whether your HO is the belt alignment is proper, your pump alignment is proper or not. So this is where we need to concentrate. On one hand, we are concentrating on the designing part. You know, going for EC uh, fans, replacing the centrifugal fans, etc. But my main concern as an operation and maintenance man is the concentrate over here also. Over here also, the awareness has to be brought up. You should take proper care of your HU fan belts. Are they properly aligned? Are your pumps working properly? How much is the flow? I am getting 7 degrees of outlet of chilled water, but my 700 TR chiller is actually working on a very uh, flow, chilled water flow rate because my filters are jammed. In fact, I may get a better delta T also. So, that is not good. You are wasting your energy. So, this concept has to be brought even to the lowest people. In operator, I should also know, okay, sir, something is going wrong. He will make a note of it in the logbook and immediately inform his superior. Okay, sir. What you have said is not going. 
over here we can we can even our uh, put up our tpm projects six sigma having a good signals uh, signs on the pressure pressure gauges etc the red signals red sign yellow sign etc if the needle is going on the red uh, red area then something is going wrong that is a panic mode you have to inform your uh, seniors ki sir ye to lal isme ja raha hai so at least that much the operator can do so there are other topics also that we need to discuss but definitely or today we are discussing ki 1 degree लोअर इन ऑपरेटर टेम्परेचर और वन डिग्री हायर इन अपना कंडेंसर विल गिव अ लॉट ऑफ एनर्जी एफिशिएंसी बट दिस प्रोबेबली विल हैव टू टेक केयर इवन द कूलिंग टावर वेदर द नोजल्स आर वर्किंग प्रॉपरली इफ यू गो टू योर कूलिंग टावर यू विल फाइंड इट फुल ऑफ मॉस टोटली चोक्ड द फिल्टर्स आर चोक्ड क्लॉग्ड बिकॉज़ ऑफ मॉस एटसेट्रा दे आर कंटीन्यूअसली रनिंग कंटीन्यूअसली रनिंग सो दिस concept has to be changed we have to bring an awareness in our operating system especially even if you go see in hospitality industries areas where you have got reception where you have got frequent door opening and closing such area you cannot control the temperature with an air conditioning for this area you need to go with air washers even 3 2 3 degrees below the ambient temperature will make you feel comfortable and if you are cooling this area with your air washers definitely you will be comfortable and you will be saving your energy but with air conditioner it is not possible your hu or your three way wall will never get activated because the reception is you got a frequent door opening and closing at times i have seen people keeping the door open only okay as far as the business is part is concerned okay you are looking the benefit of the guest but at the same time if you have got to do something power saving then you have to do you have to convert that air conditioning area into an air washer area install good air washers we get beautiful make air washers at the so this is what i wanted to go okay this is from my side end thank you mr rani for shedding the significance of energy saving in hvac design and operation